What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Pick Plug back again with another video. And today, I'll be hopping to Thursday's picks for today. Now, if you guys are tailing any of these picks, comment down below which picks you will be tailing because we are looking to cash out on all of these picks. Right now, as of uh, as of right now, I do know that we did cash out on the Boston picks. We had uh, Derek White cash out, and that was an easy cash out. He ended up hitting the line in the first half, which is absolutely amazing, and we love to see those type of wins. Now, we have been winning like crazy in our Discord, so if, again, you guys do want to join our Discord, click that link in the description below, and you guys can cash out on the Discord. We are looking to have an amazing month this month, and our algorithm is definitely looking like it is going to be very profitable as it has been in the past so we are definitely looking to have a solid solid month so if you are looking to join now is the time make sure to subscribe and turn your post notifications because a lot of these picks do get changed because these are early prop picks you guys want to get the most value out of these picks and also make sure to smash that uh, like button uh, let's get this video to 250 likes if you guys do want a five pick parlay in tomorrow's video but without further ado let's hop into today's picks for our first prop, we'll be going to the points section, scrolling down all the way to the uh, Obi Toppin 8.5 points, and this one is going to be for more. Now, I'm looking at his prop, and he has hit this line in four straight games, and he's averaging eight, uh, 10.6 in his last five, which is definitely a solid, solid match to go on the over for it. Now, looking here, we can see he's gone on the over, having 12 points, 13 points, 15 points and this is all solid lines because he has been pretty consistent with going on the over and looking here on outlier which again you guys can go ahead and check out for yourself by clicking that link in the description below you guys can try it out for free for seven days and uh, have some solid chances to win money now he has hit this line in eight out of his last 10 games and the games that he did fall short uh, he only fell short by a couple of points very very slim chance of him to go on the under for this prop now i do see him going on the over because we can see he has hit this line in four straight games head to head and he's hit this line in seven out of the last 10 games head to head going up against milwaukee overall this matchup is looking very good because overall they are 21st in points allowed and against the powerful position they are giving up 22.9 points versus the power four position and his prop is only 18 8.5 so i can see him uh, having a solid time because he also does average around 18 minutes per game his last game he did have 22 uh, minutes and he did have a 16.5 minute game um, and he did um, go on the over for that prop pretty easily so I do see him go on the over for this line he's actually hit this line 10 out of his last 12 games so that's pretty impressive he's pretty consistent with this line so if you guys are telling this prop let me know down in the comment section below if you guys are liking this prop you can also throw it on sleeper right now they do have a free prop um, and they also do post free props every single day. All you guys got to do is click that link in the description below and use code trophy on sleeper and you can get up to $500 on your first deposit match as well as right now they do have a up to 100 times on your payout boost promotion. So you guys can take advantage of that as well That's a very, very solid chance to go ahead and take advantage of uh, that chance. So make sure to click that link in the description below, download sleeper and use code trophy on your first deposit match. Also join the Discord because I'll be posting five free plays. The free Discord, I'll be posting five free plays in there. So make sure to join up on that as well. For our next prop, we'll be going to the points plus rebounds plus assist section. Going down to Chris Middleton, 41.5 PRA. And this one is going to be for less. Now, Chris Middleton is one of the most inconsistent players. And as of recently, um, ever since his injury, he has not been the same player. And we can see that he is averaging 41.2, but that is because of his recent game having 50, uh, 46 PRA. Most of the time in this series, he has gone the under. And if we look on outlier, we can see that head to head, he has gone the under 10 out of his last 12 games going up against Indiana. So this is also accounting for the fact that Damian Lillard isn't going to be playing. He is listed as doubtful, but even if he does play or if he doesn't play, he most likely will go on the under. If he does play, he will get less minutes and less ball attention. Um, so he most likely will go on the under because of that. But simply because of the fact that he isn't um, is, is as good as a scorer as he was before, he most likely will go on the under still, whether if he plays or not. He has yet to been uh, break 30 points. Um, in his last 20 games, let's see if he's broken 30 points. No, he has not broken 30 points a single time in his last 20 games. So um, this we can see that this is a solid, solid uh, choice to go on the under four. If you guys are telling this problem, let me know down in the comment section below. 
I also do want to mention an alternative prop, which is 2.5 three pointers. And this one is going to be for less. Now, looking here, I do think this is a solid, solid chance to go on the under just as an alternate prop. We can see a head to head. He's gone on the under um, eight out of the last 12 games. We can see that um, he's been pretty bad going for this line. And they are first in three points made allowed. They do a very good job with defending the three point line. And he has failed to go on the over head to head. So I also do think this is a solid prop because looking here on DG Fantasy, they do have him listed as under. And a lot of these sports books are favoriting him to go on the under. So if you guys do want a tool like this where you can see the different odds throughout different sports books and you can line shop like this and see the specific odds for prize picks and other sports books, make sure to go ahead and click that link in the description below. Use code TROPHY for 25% off your first month and you guys can get access to amazing tools like this. They have so many different odds um, of basically almost all the plays on prize picks. So make sure to go ahead and check it out. For our final prop, we'll be going to the rebounds plus assists tab, scrolling down to Jalen Brunson, 11.5 rebounds plus assists. And this one is going to be for more. Looking here, we can see that he's averaging 13.2 in his last five games. His last game was a little bit of a rocky one, and he did end up having nine rebounds plus assists. But for the most part in this series, he has consistently gone on the over for this line, and he has gone on the over pretty um, with a pretty large gap, having 14 here, 15, 14, and 14 here when his line was 11.5. I do see them increasing this line later on in the day. That is why it is valuable to have your post notifications turned on because later on in the day, if they do bump it up to 12 uh, PR uh, rebounds plus assists, I do believe that that is a less valuable prop. Now, looking here, we can see head-to-head. -head. He's hit this line 10 out of the last 13 games. He's at, This is a 77% chance for him to hit this, which is a pretty solid odd. He's going up against a team that is 10th in rebounds allowed and 10th uh, in assists allowed. But again, if you have all of these averages put together and the, the minimum of these, he will be able to go on the over of, of it easily. And he has been hitting those averages, um, as we can see. Uh, I don't see him struggling to go on the over for this at all because, again, he has hit this line in seven out of his last 10 games. And if we check in away games, we can see head-to-head -head, he's hit this line in five out of his last six games, which is 83%. So that's even a better percentage um, when it comes to home games. So I do see him playing a lot of minutes this game as well. He does average 39 minutes at home against these uh, 76ers. He does. Uh, he had uh, 43 minutes in his last game and 45 in his game before that. So he plays a lot, especially against the 76ers. So I definitely have a lot of confidence in this play, especially um, if you guys are looking to tell it. So let me know down in the comment section below which picks you guys will be telling as well as the other picks in today's video or some picks that you guys have come up with yourself. Let me know all of them down in the comment section below and make sure to smash that like button, hit that subscribe button if you guys do want more content like this early picks and also check out my tiktok i have posted two bonus picks for you guys down in the tiktok in the comment section below the top pin comments so check those out as well but thank you guys for watching and i will catch you guys in the next one peace